Hi, welcome to part two of your 30 day detox instruction video. This video is for anyone that's in week one, day one of their 30 day detox. And I want to point out what I'm screen sharing right now is your ID Life shopping website. And the information that I'm discussing is also found when you go to the detox product page. So if you have clicked shop and you have selected detox, that's going to land you right here on this page. But what you may not have noticed, besides looking at the price and your options, is that your instructions are right here. So I'm going to scroll down and it talks about what the process is and what the benefits are. So anytime I start a program, I always want to know why am I doing this? What am I doing and why am I doing it? The 30-day detox with the Cleanse Plus in the first five days is going to help you prep your gut. It's going to clean everything out. It's kind of like a power wash for the system. I also nickname it an oil change for the body. So in this whole process, we want to flush the kidneys, the liver, and the colon and reset your gut microbiome. So pretty much all the filters of the body are about to get a good scrubbing. So that's like a power wash. This is the reason you need to be drinking your water. You should be up to a gallon a day. And I know that sounds like a lot. So maybe you should be prepping ahead while you're waiting for your box to come and start adding an extra eight ounce glass of water before and after every single meal. If you're already ready to start your detox and you still haven't gotten to a gallon of water, here's a life hack. Chug 32 ounces in the morning before you have anything else. It may take you five minutes. It may take you 20 minutes. 32 ounces is not a whole lot. This is 20. So I definitely make sure I get 20 to 32 ounces first thing in the morning. That actually wakes my metabolism up and helps me start going um, regularly in the morning. So the detox and the cleanse plus. This is video number two. If you haven't watched the cleanse plus video, pause here, go back to the other link. So let's talk about the journey of the detox week one. When you scroll down past your product image, you'll notice that there's days one through five, six through 20, and 21 through 30. I love that we have a beautiful website to support you on your journey. When you click learn more, it shares with you what it is that we're doing and why we're doing it in the first five days. So you're going to do the cleanse plus first thing in the morning before you have any food, shake it, drink it in one sitting. And you're also going to open up your AM packet. There'll be a little pill. It's the kidney detox pill. There's going to be a little sunshine on that packet. That's your morning packet. Next time you pull that packet out, you're going to see a moon symbol on it. That's also a kidney pill. That's your PM packet. So you want to do morning and night every single day consecutively. So what are we doing during the kidney detox? We're actually supporting the kidney with plant-based key nutrients to help its natural filtration system. So this is going to give it powerful antioxidants to kick it into overdrive to flush those toxins that you've been exposed to. At the same time, the Cleanse Plus is a little bit lower in the body and that is scrubbing with that psyllium husk, that pulp that you felt and tasted when you were drinking it. It's helping clean any debris away. Remember, the goal is make sure the filters are clean so they can get rid of the toxins and then clean out the tubes so that that lining isn't getting in the way of absorbing all of the good foods and clean foods that you're eating. Remember, your body's like a sponge. And if it can't get to the sponge because there's gook in the way, you're only absorbing a portion of your food. What a waste of money. All right, if you are interested in the scientific process and all of the things that are going on, you can meet the doctor behind the system that pioneered it for over 10 years and has loads of research on the benefits of each of the ingredients and specifically why we're doing it in the order that we're doing it. So key point before I let you go, drink your water, make sure you're having a gallon a day, eat clean foods. And if we're not tracking it, we don't know how consistent we're being. So drink your gallon of water. And how do you know you're going to do that? Make sure that you print your tracker. So simple little checkbox. I've had my water. I've moved my body. I have been choosing clean, healthy foods. 
I'm doing something positive, and I'm taking my ID Life supplements. Some people choose to rate this on a scale of one to five so that they, it's not an all or none system. I love that. Five being I hit the target. I ate four healthy meals a day. I had four 32 ounces of water, which is, by the way, you're getting to a gallon there. Um, some people put two checks for the ID nutrition. And so on a, that scale of one to five, you can really rate like, did I eat clean five times or four times today? Did I get all of my water? Um, I love doing that system. Also, since we're going to day one, you're going to notice bloating and that belly bulge, and sometimes that mushroom top going away, especially if you have a lot of buildup in the tubes in the intestines. You may also notice that your inflammation is going down because your filters are finally able to drain that old water. So how do you know that the detox is working? Well, the scale is not the only way that we can measure change in the body. Pictures and tape measurements are fantastic. So I challenge you, you put good money down. Let's show our results because you know what? People are going to start asking what you're doing and you'll have real data to say, I've lost 10 inches around my waist in 30 days, which by the way, I lost 16 and that was phenomenal. Everybody was asking and they said, how much weight have you lost? And I actually hadn't lost any weight. I just changed shape and I'll take that over a movement in the scale any day. You also have a log where you can write down any questions and send that to your coach or just observe how you're feeling. You should start feeling more energy and better quality sleep. And other things that you've been looking to change, make a note, see if you're changing. All right. One more thing that I think is really beneficial, and that is how do we eat? How do we eat a balanced meal? Not everybody is a fan of measuring, but you've got your two hands with you all day. So fruits and veggies, those go in the cup of your hand, protein right here in the palm of the hand, oils, butters, fats tip of the thumb, and then whole grain foods right here, the width of your fist. So don't be having pasta, even if it's whole grain and doing massive servings of pasta, build your plate to look like this. All right, here are some grocery lists and suggestions, healthy fats, healthy fruits and vegetables and proteins. What you want to limit sugar, alcohol, fast food, processed foods, artificial sweeteners, because they still mess with that gut microbiome and fried foods. Do you have to be perfect? No, we're looking for 80% efficiency. So make sure you connect with your coach if you have any questions. And if you don't see the foods that you love on this list, it's not all inclusive. Talk with your coach, the person that invited to you to watch this video. And they're an expert at helping you strategize and plan for a successful journey. All right, good luck during week one. Make sure you share questions and comments with your coach. I didn't get that. <laughs> Neither did Surrey. Uh, <laughs> they're there to support you along the way. Have a great day.